Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to simplify a complex rational expression by writing it as division. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here. Simplify 1 over x plus 1 over y all over x over y minus y over x. We got a lot of division here. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5 divisions really going on. We have some fractions, and we want to, well, combine these fractions first in the numerator, and the large fraction, and the denominator here. So we're going to worry about this and that. Well, we want to find a common denominator in the first parts here, 1 over x and 1 over y. So to do that, I have 1 over x here. I'm going to multiply it by the other denominator, y over y, or denominator over itself. Remember, any number over itself is equal to 1. Plus, we have 1 over y. I'm going to do the same thing with the x as a denominator, times x over x. Now, same thing down here for the second part. We have x over y minus y over x. x over y, I want to multiply that by the other denominator so we can combine it, which is an x over an x. We have y over x here, the other denominator being a y. Multiply it by y over y. Now take your time with this. It's very easy to get your x and y's confused. Or pause this video, take a look at it if you need to. From there, I'm going to combine what we have here. I really see this as four quadrants. One, two, three, and four. One times y is a y. x times y is an xy. Plus, one times x is an x. y times x is a, well, xy to keep it uniform here. Same thing down here, x times x is an x squared over y times x. Let's keep it xy, so we're just all in the same order, x comes first. Minus here, y times y is a y squared, and x times y is an xy. Hopefully you stayed with me so far. From here, what I'm going to do is rewrite this as a division problem now. Okay, Division problem, and I'm going to combine what I can, kind of two parts in one. Notice we have the same denominator up here, okay, same denominator. Actually, let's just do that here. I have a space. Same denominator, we have xy over y plus x. Makes it easier to see. All over x squared minus a y squared, and that denominator is also an xy. All right. Now let's go split it up with a division sign. We have y plus x over an xy. And instead of dividing everything, we're going to rewrite it like this with the division symbol. And actually, this is a great moment to pause and see what I did here. I was about to skip some steps and realized it might be too difficult to follow. And so I put an extra step. Didn't take too long to do that. And, well, now we fully understand more of what's going on. So don't worry about taking your time. It's all good. All right. Denominator here, we have x squared minus a y squared over x, y. From there, like always, division is the same thing as multiplication, just flipping the fraction around. So we have y plus x over an xy times here, we have xy over an x squared minus a y squared. All right. From here, we can combine by multiplying across, right? Across the numerator, across the denominator. But I'm going to keep everything factored as much as possible. Let's put our xy's first. So xy comes out here, xy times y plus x. All over, xy comes first. Now I'm going to factor the second denominator. x squared minus y squared is an x minus a y and an x plus a y. All right? Hopefully you can remember that. Now, this is where it gets kind of fun. X is cancel, Y is cancel. We got X, Y, numerator, denominator. Great. Y plus X is the same thing as X plus Y. They cancel. So what are we left with? We're left with just a 1 over an X minus Y in the denominator. And there we have it. This whole thing that we had simplified to just be a 1 over X minus a Y. Well, I hope you learned something here on how to simplify a complex rational expression by writing it as division. If you did, make sure you like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.